I'm gonna try to catch up. Hi everyone. So today, rather than me doing a budget with me and doing a separate video of me cash stuffing, I'm gonna be doing everything in one video and hopefully it'll be quick because there really isn't much to do as I already unstuff, unstuffed some things and you guys will see what I'm talking about. Um, a whole lot happened last week, uh, but let me just open it and show you guys, I guess, right? But to begin, if you are new, I am happy you are here and I hope you stick around. And if you like what you see, make sure you hit that like button, the subscribe button, and I hope I will see you guys every single week. Um, and if you are a returning subscriber, welcome back. I'm so happy you're here. Please leave some comments like you always do. Show your girl some love and I will comment right back. I always do. Um, and I think that's it. So let's get started. So, um, last time we looked at my budgeting thing, I think we ended for the 17th. Um, I unstuffed what I needed to unstuff and I got my tax return back. So I just have to figure out how I'm going to budget the money that I got for taxes because I have to pay myself back for spending this money for concerts and um, a couple things happened. As you can see, the 18th we spent nothing, 19 nothing, 20 nothing, 21st nothing. So yay for those four days. Unfortunately, on Monday... Um, we had to take our dog to the emergency room because the homegirl was just pooping. She had like full-blown diarrhea. And we thought, okay, maybe that, that's fine. But then blood started coming out. So then we got scared. So we took it to the emergency room. They gave us some pills. They said her kidney number was a little elevated. Nothing to be too crazy about. They just sent the info to our vet and then sent us on our way home. Along with a lovely bill of $440. So, in my short-term binder, you guys are going to see almost everything there is empty because I had to take out the money to be able to see if I could pay myself back without having to take out, um, well, I had, I had to find a way to pay myself back. So, I ended up finding the money for that. And you guys are going to see that binder is empty and is going to need some love, but it's okay. Diosito came through. And I got my taxes right after this happened. So all the money that I unstuffed, I think goodness will be able to stuff it back to the number it was. And then add a little more because I just need to make sure we are prepared for the next time. And I also upped our pet food because I included my dog's medicine in that um, number rather than constantly having to take out of pet emergency. Because pet emergency, I really don't want to touch it unless it's actually an emergency. Um, or if I have to take my dog to like a regular vet visit, not in a, not like a, just because I need to buy medicine, I'm going to take money out of her emergency envelope. You know what I mean? So I included her medicine into our um, pet food envelope. So I that went up to 100 and the money that I'll be adding in the pet emergency is only going to be strictly for actual emergencies or um, when we take our uh, pets to like the yearly vet exam. So with that, I also went to Chipotle with my hubby. So we spent $23.79 and Petco, um, I bought my cat Cusco his food. So that was $83.46 and I also pumped gas which was 5819 so we will not be stuffing our gas envelope um rather than taking out the money out of the bank i just forwarded i transferred the 60 dollars from my bank account into the credit card to just pay that off i want to say that's it so yeah my girl is doing okay though um the medicine that we have her on just full-blown has her sleeping the whole day and i might sound a little groggy right now because i just woke up and I'm like, you know what? I need to film this video before it gets too late. 
Um, and I also had to go out yesterday for a friend's birthday, so I will not be stuffing my food envelope either because I didn't have time to film before I went out. So I just took out the money for food and gas isn't going to be filled. So I think the only one that is going to be stuffed is my Cynthia um, little envelope for my wallet. That is it for that. Thank goodness I got my tax return. So I'll be able to pay myself back for all this crazy spending. Um, and I'll be able to put my money back to my um, envelopes that need to and then put it back to where the number that it was plus some so i just have to do the numbers and figure it out to be able to do that but that is it for my planner so we will move along to my lovely empty binder but it's okay it's gonna get love again like you guys are gonna see it's all empty i have to like empty it out but it's okay that's really the point of it right like I was able to save that money so then I could pay myself back and I didn't have to take out from anything I didn't have to use my credit card and then slowly pay it off so yeah all right I have my little cheat sheet over here I did the little breakdown so we can get started let's do before I do that let me do my wallet and just do my little five dollars Oh, right? I got five dollars. Since you had to use that five dollars, girl, I don't know. Did I budget myself to get five dollars? I should have. I guess I'll just leave myself flaps just in case. This is the food money that was left over. Uh, let's see what else is in here. Yeah, so food. Oh, and I did these like envelopes, but they came out so bad because I didn't let my flowers dry because these are the flowers I got for Valentine's Day and I was like oh that would be cute to use it before they die it ain't cute because they didn't come out nice <laughs> so this will just be you know a little learning process and we're gonna try it again I'm drying flowers now to see if maybe it does something this is my receipts I'm gonna put my code up on the screen for anybody that wants to use the receipt app so you get rewards and you earn points and eventually leads to free gift cards i just got my 40 dollars gift card for receipt hog for doing it yes receipt hog takes a while before you get your points to be able to get your gift cards but eventually you get them and i got a nice 40 dollars gift card so it's okay well i got money sent to paypal and that's the other thing now i don't know what i'm gonna do because paypal asked me for my social security number for tax reasons because I also sold my Billie Eilish tickets and I was like 300 something dollars. And I guess after 600, they're gonna start taxing. So I don't know if I wanna use PayPal anymore. Maybe I have to figure out something else. I don't know. Like for Rakuten, I think I have to let them send me a check rather than pay me through. What am I doing? Excuse me, rather than paying me through PayPal, I might just have them send me checks again. I don't know what I'm gonna do because them taxing money that's mine it ain't right like what are you doing no 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 so I'm not gonna stuff my envelope I'm not really sure if I put money towards that or not so I'm just gonna skip that for now if we have five dollars left over we know it's for that I guess I could just leave this close by just in case I do need it right yes okay zero pet food is not gonna get anything because I spent um on my back who y'all we shoveled there was like a snowstorm and y'all girl was shoveling and my back hurts now this body ain't built for that okay we spent cusco 83.46 i'm going to be transferring 60 dollars to pay myself back because this 83 is really, we're going to round up to 84 and that 84 is going to be split into two because my hubby and I share our pet's foods expenses. So he's going to be giving me uh, $42. So I only transferred 60 to be able to cover the 42 and to be able to cover, there was another purchase I did for pet and I said I was going to pay myself back. Oh, this Petco one, I think it was, I don't remember anymore. No, the Amazon for the pills. That's what I told myself I was going to pay myself back. So I'm doing that. 
pay myself back by sending sixty dollars and just paying off my credit card for that so nothing for pet food for this time uh pet care is going to get ten dollars now i'm gonna recount anything because my lovely envelopes are empty the only one i didn't empty out was my car maintenance because my oil is due and i was like that's one less thing i gotta put in my credit card i'm not going to touch this unless i really had to but thankfully with my envelopes i came up with that money so i didn't have to touch this so thank goodness for that um car maintenance is gonna get 50 because i do have to do my oil change so that's gonna get two 20s and 110 so that's 50 and now we have 50 70 90 110 130 150 160 yeah 160 i was like did i count right <laughs> health is going to get five dollars i'm gonna start this over also at least my girl is okay so you know that's all that really matters um because my baby was scaring me date night is gonna get five vacation is going to get five and if i didn't say we're gonna be stuffing 300 it was supposed to be 500 with my food and stuff but since i took all that out we're stuffing 300 dollars greens is going to get five and i also printed some more um things to decorate more envelopes so if you guys are interested in watching another video let me know if you're not then i'll just do my own decorating off camera but if you are interested in looking then um i'll do another video and show you guys how i decorate it and I also there's a couple of ones that i can't really decide on so i might put up a like a little poll for you guys to vote to see if um which one i should do because i'm not really sure like i think i have a birthday one where i like two but i'm not sure which one to pick so i might just do that and let you guys pick um so that'll be something fun to do if you guys are even interested if y'all don't care about that let me know and i won't even do it <laughs> and i'll just do it on my own time because you know i don't want to make things that you guys don't want to watch right uh let's see housing is going to get 15 housing is aka wedding okay envelope open up please so wedding got 15 and rent is getting 150 and that completes our rent for the month so honey bunny is going to be getting the money today for that and this is money that i have to go this is the money that i pulled out of the envelopes that I have to put back into the bank. So that is that for my short term. And then I did not touch my events binder. Just, just th this was also like a last resort one because I know that this money here all has like, I just don't want to use my credit card. So I'm like, you know what? I'm going to pull as much money as I can in my short term. And that if I really, really, really need money, I was going to pull it out of here. But thankfully, I didn't. So it's all okay. So for Xmas, I was going to get $20. So now we have $120. And I think I wanted to place holders for any time I go over $100. Because I just don't want to have so much money at home. Just in case, because you never, never, never know what the heck is going to happen. So just in case, um, I think any time that it's going to go over 100, I'm going to do a placeholder, take that money and deposit it into my Capital One savings. So at least it grows a little bit of interest. It's not going to be much interest, but at least it'll grow something, you know? Um, but yeah, birthday is also going to get $20. So now we have 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 10, 15. So 115 for birthdays. Anniversary is going to get 10. So now we have 50. Valentine's Day gets nothing. Ooh, this is all sticky right here. 
Valentine's Day gets nothing. And Mother's Day gets nada. And Kinse is going to get the last $5. So it's a good thing that I didn't take a five because I didn't budget the $5 for myself. So that's good. And I didn't have any money left over. So nothing with ones, nothing with fives. I don't really think Bay has anything on his desk. Nope. So nothing with ones or fives for tip this time. And it's fine. It is what it is, right? And I think that's it, y'all. It was a nice short video. I'm so sorry for that. Um, nothing really exciting. <laughs> Not much stuffing. Uh, but I will be doing a budget with me for my tax return. So be on the lookout for that. Hopefully, I might just make get this video out if not today maybe tomorrow and aka today is saturday so just because you know i'm combining the budget with not budget with me the weekly recap and my um catch stuff in video in one so i might just do that because i think this video is really short anyway so yes that is it thank you so much for watching if you stuck around leave a llama emoji because i love llamas and you know leave me some comments let's chit chat i love chit chatting with everybody i love chat chatting with every single one of you i hope you have a blessed day have an amazing weekend have an amazing week keep being amazing and i will see you in our next video bye